Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Um, today I am here with another unboxing. I know Marissa did one last week, but it's my turn to do one. Not that this is my purchase, but it's our purchase. Um, and you've already seen half of the bag already, um, but it's from Dior. So, um, last week, you may have seen in our vlog, we went to Dior um, for like a styling session with um, one of the head stylists there. And we went and tried on a few pieces of the new collection. Um, and then we, she had some shoes to try on just um, for the outfits. And I was like, oh my gosh, you have these shoes. And Marissa's like, oh my gosh, you have these shoes. Um, without her realizing that we were wanting them for a long time in, um, but yeah, I'm not gonna give too much away until we get into the box. Um, so, my phone here has got all the details of the shoes on here. So, obviously, it's a pair of shoes. Um, it comes in this iconic Dior bag with a Dior logo on it. Um, if we open it up, we've got the um, sort of accordion style tissue paper, which they do. Um, they've given us a Dior sort of. It's got Marissa's name on it because she's the one that made the transaction. Um, Dior coffee table book with a new collection with their beautiful classic signature Dior um, ribbon on it, which is so beautiful. And then um, if we go inside the bag, we've got the Dior shoe box. So obviously Dior packaging is so iconic. Um, we've bought one thing from Dior before, which were my earrings. So obviously you've seen them before, um, my double pearl earrings. Um, this obviously is a little bit bigger than the earrings, um, so it's a pair of shoes, so I'll unbox them quickly for you. Okay, cool. So that's all done, taking the bow off. Uh, so, my oh, no, I'm over the truth, but you can't see anything inside yet. So, take the lid off, and we've got um, the Dior little. What is this? It's just like the about manufacturing and the craftsmanship. So a little like slip about that. Comes with that. Just pop back here. We've got um, the dust bag. There's one for each shoe, which is awesome, with their um, embroidered logo on it. And then if we peel back the layers, I think they're in plastic as well. They are. Just so about the layers. These are sort of what you see of the shoes so far. So some of you were able to tell what they are already. Um, they were in our Instagram story saying these just came home with us. Um, so super excited. They had them in our size as well, so rare. We were looking for them, the kitten heel versions for quite a while. Um, and they just sold it everywhere, unfortunately, um, which was understandable because they were really iconic. Um, so I'm just going to the box down. So, these are the shoes. So, if you can see, they're the little ballerina flats with the sling back with the signature digital door um, embroidery on it. They are, I've got the information of the shoes. So, these are called the ballerina in technical canvas and Jador ribbon, one centimeter. So, pretty self-explanatory. They've got, um, a sort of textured um, finish on the foot, on the actual, the main material. Um, and then um, the sling back is a leather interior and a canvas sort of outside. Um, they've got the iconic star underneath the shoes, um, as a lot of the Christian Dior pieces do, the star um, symbolizes something that is done for quite a long time. Um, so that's these ones. Now, I don't have, I'll find the receipt. So these are available in store only. We got ours from the Collins Street Boutique in Melbourne. Um, and the lady was quite surprised that she even had them from our size. She's like, these are here and they're all yours. So that's really exciting. Oh, that's so sweet. Um, so the lady that we purchased them off, she goes, dear Marissa, well, Marissa bought the actual shoes. Um, it's been so beautiful having you and Beck in our Collins Street Boutique today. I love the spirit you both have. It's um, undeniably Dior. That's so sweet. <laughs> I hope you leave today loving um, our storied house as much as I do. Love Hillary and the Dior team. Thank you. Okay, so Marissa's just come in. She's given me 
my letter. So obviously, I didn't realize we had one each, which is, I'm really excited to read another one. It's probably the same as Marissa's, let's be honest. Dear Beth, thank you so much for joining us in the College Street Petite today. You guys are the next generation of Dior women, and I hope you leave today love the house as much as we do. You love Hillary and the Dior team. Seriously, it's so unbelievably sweet. So Hillary was amazing. Um, like I said, we went in there to try the new collection, just as Dior is like an iconically mature, like a mature woman sort of brand. Um, it was exciting to go in there as someone who's 25 years old and style things the way we would wear Dior pieces. So I think you may have seen uh, photos on our Instagram. If not, we'll pop a photo somewhere. Um, from the, one of the outfits we shot in Dior. Um, but I think it's just about styling things how you would and how you wear every day. There's this beautiful embroidered coat that I tried on. It was um, hand stitched. So that I'm like, I would just wear jeans and flats and a t-shirt. So if it maybe someone who's an older may start only start for an evening event, whereas we love that we could style things more every day or I guess more paired back than normal. And I absolutely love it. I had the best experience. But back to the unboxing. These are the shoes. Obviously, um, they're comfortable because they're flats. Um, I think we paid a thousand and fifty Australian dollars for them, um, which is on par to the Gucci um, Prince Town loafers with the fur or the fuzz. Um, so for us, we know how much we wear those shoes and how much value we have out of those shoes. And because we're traveling to London Paris Fashion Week in September, we wanted a pair of shoes that we could wear every day as flats, walk around the streets in, and still feel cool and chic. And so I could wear these with a pair of skinny black jeans, a white shirt, Gucci belt, and feel really chic, really, really cool, and also styled as well, while still being super comfortable. So that's why we got these. Um, really excited to wear them. I haven't worn them yet. Obviously, we just literally unbox them here and there. We've been dying to wear them all week, but we haven't because... They're for the YouTube first. Um, yes, that's it. Um, that's the quickest unboxing ever. I know I'm just like, bang, bang, bang. These are the shoes. Anyway, let us know what you think. If you like them, would you wear these? How about you let us know below how you would style them? Um, and I guess you guys know how we would style them. Like, standard, like, mum jean, blazer t-shirt. That's kind of our vibe. But if you want us to do a video on, like, five ways, five different ways to style ballerina flats, um, let us know in the comments below. We love trying new videos and I guess it'll kind of break our mold of wearing these the way we normally would. Um, so let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video, give it a thumbs up and comment down below um, what your thoughts about the shoes and subscribe to our channel. Thanks so much guys. See ya.